So the uh, the Holy High Five, the Holy Water Cross Slap, uh, which, which is an obnoxious video I did a while back, um, I'll summarize. Somebody does something, and it, it's it doesn't uh, it, it's mystifying. It doesn't make any sense what they just did. So you say, "Hey, I don't understand why you did that. Um, could you clear it up for me?" And they go, "Oh, why did I do that?" Which is a sign of possession. Someone's doing something that uh, they they don't uh, not of their own free will. They're not uh, not of their own volition. And uh, so it occurs to me they might be uh, uh, possessed. And so you uh, you splash holy water in their face and you slap them with a cross and uh, the holy high five. And if uh, if that that cross leads a red mark on their face, another sign of possession. <laughs> so the reason why that's an obnoxious observation, <laughs> of course, I just want you to know that I get it. Um, is because this is something, it's a human thing to do, it's something we all do. But I, I re, I'm really interested in uh, the motivations behind these things. And I think Almafara had cleared it up for me. Um, and that uh, he was talking about being, uh, waiting for somebody, and uh, while he was waiting, someone else walked up. And as a person walked up, Almafara unzipped his backpack and uh, started to put his hand in. He's like, Wait a minute. What am I? Uh, what am I doing? And later he thought about it and and thought that uh, like the last time he saw this person, um, maybe he had something in his backpack to hand to him, uh, or maybe that person actually handed some. He was waiting for that person at one point in time for him to give him something. He was going to put it in his backpack, and so there was still kind of like a shadow of a muscle memory, a shadow of an intention to do a certain thing. Um, even if that thing didn't wasn't you know relevant pertinent it wasn't happening <laughs> and uh, so I think I think that's the uh, that's what the uh, the holy high five is uh, a response to is uh, is our habits our uh, our, our sha the kind of shadowy part of our mind and memory uh, and plans plans for actions that uh, give us you know subtle hints subtle suggestions. And we get we get used to find uh, following them without thinking about it because it's like as I walk out the door, I'm like, huh, something feels weird. And so, I'll, oh, keys, wallet, no phone. Gotta get my phone. So I uh, I stopped. I didn't know why, and I started doing an action without really thinking about it. And it and it worked. I then remembered my phone, and so I got positive reinforcement. So when I do something that uh, seems senseless, um, I'm like, why didn't I think about that? Because I did it out of habit, even though the habit at this point in time isn't effective. Like there's, some, there's something that I always do a certain way, but sometimes it can't be done that way. But when it can't be done that way, sometimes I figured it out just because I go, whoop, oh, I can't, I can't go this way because I just blocked this way off. Huh. And I knew that. Why did I? Why did I try to go that way? So that would be like you know, throw holy water in my face, take a swing at me with a cross. But uh, but yeah, it doesn't mean uh, we're possessed. It means that uh, though it does, it does. You are getting signals from a, a quiet part of your brain. Uh, you are getting uh, uh, instructions from the shadows. Um, but they don't come from demons. They just come from that that kind of second thought. Second thoughts and habits. Have I forgotten something, or this is what I normally do, or this seems so sim similar to something that happened in the past, I start reacting to that past circumstance, even though the current circumstance, it's no longer appropriate. So it seems like possession. possession. All right, so I think, I think I put that holy water cross, cross slap thing uh, to bed. I think I've got. It, I think I've got it worked out. So uh, even as it, even as I brought it up, it felt like an obnoxious topic. But I really kind of wanted to get to the bottom of it. I just didn't know how to do it in a less obnoxious way. <laughs> All right. I'll slap you in the tubes. <laughs>